congratulations if you've downloaded this tracker already so this is income and expense tracker which um, helps you track your finances your personal finances and i made it as simple as possible so if you don't like excel this is the best tracker for you so the, what you're currently looking at now is the summary sheets and below you have the month from january to december so i split the month in different sheets so that it doesn't look clumsy i understand a lot of people don't really like excel so that's why i split the month into different sheets and i labeled them accordingly to the sheets let's go back to the summer sheet so on this summer sheet you have the title which is the personal finance you have the income so this income reflects income for the total month and the expense for the total month that is january to december and balance so let's say you don't want to see for the total month let's say you want to see for maybe june to um you want to select let me use the word select you want to use select so that's where this part comes in so where you have month here this is the slicer that helps you pick so on this slicer you have month and when you put your mouse on this you have multi select you can see my multi select is highlighted it kind of have like yellow right so that means i can multi select different months currently right now we are in june so if you are downloading this item in june you might want to take out from january to may if you don't have the details right now so i will take out my january to may so let's say at the end of the month you just want to see january to may sorry you want to see from june to december so i took out january to me i want to see from june to december so from june to december i'm seeing uh my income from june to december is or should i say was twenty seven thousand seven ninety, and my expense so uh, twenty four thousand plus and my balance is three thousand so this three thousand make me know what should i invest in or what should i use this money for so that is for multi select so and if you want to clear this filter you see the x here yes just clear it and it goes back to the full month so let's say you want to select just one month to see how your expense remember this is a filter you might not really need this all the time except maybe you want to specific because i still break it down here for you to see everything so on this side you also have the tabular form of what you're having on the charts here so if you do just want to select one month just click this um go back to your slicer and click this um, button here that says multi select you see it's no longer highlighted then you can pick just january so when you pick just january now you only have january showing so for january you have a monthly balance of 811 so when you go to your january sheets here you can see your monthly balance is 811 and your income and expense is that so you have 3158 for your uh what's this one now for your income 3158 that is for your monthly expense so that is how it is so let's go back to multi select and select everything so if you want to go back to monthly select you can still um still go back to and click it and pick everything so that you see how it works so that is how the chart works so now i'm going to go to the sheet to show you so for the sheets let's go to january i already picked what because I already like imputed what most people make their income from and also what the expenses are so before i go further i would like to say that don't be scared if you if you delete anything because i've protected it with a password to make life easier no formula needed no formula needed no formula needed let me say that again people run away from excel because of formulas all the places with formulas have been protected so you don't be scared you're going to delete the formula i've protected all the spaces with formula so all you have to do is impute so where you have this part here is where you're going to impute let's say 
none of this applies to you so you can delete it like i said i just imputed that so you can delete this off and let's say your salary you don't get salary from other sources except sorry you don't get you don't get income from other sources except your salary so you can delete that off this sheet this um template is super easy to understand so let's say you only got your salary and you've not made any expense yet yeah you can still come here impute your salary and wait for when you make expense and you come to your summary sheet now on your summary sheet you have to refresh and to refresh you go to you see home here look at my cursor see home here insert pay layout formulas data so you go to the data and you see refresh click refresh so when you refresh you can see your january now the income has dropped to 3200 and you don't have any expense yet for the month so you can see your monthly balance still remains as 3200 now let's go back to confirm you shall see how it is now when you come to your expense and you feel it okay my utilities that spent this month is 300 or my food you can even do this before you spend so that you want to caution the way you spend so this is my food for the month so you now go back to after filling it you go to back to your summer sheet and you refresh so when you refresh even without refreshing the table here automatically changes so refreshing affects your charts here so for for january now we have 500 for expense and our income still remains the same so now you can say okay i'm still earning the same thing let me look for a side hustle that this just guides your finance your personal finance and how it's going for the month of january you save 2700 and that 2700 you can channel it into investment into any other thing so that is why this is called a tracker so at the end of you, you know what is left for you you know what to do with it so that is it um so you filled it out you edit the the income aspects and the expense according to how it suits you so i filled it out for all of them you can decide to delete them or you just you decide to impute edit like this internet i said okay my internet is not 100 but my internet is 50 so impute 50 there and this is the month of march so that has changed to 2879 so you go back and you refresh that you can see it has changed that for you for the month of march see 2879 so that is it this is a simple excel template to track your in your income and your expense so if you have any question at all please do well to drop it in the comment section wherever you're seeing this and i'll do well to explain for that or if you're stuck or you don't know what to do just let me know or you download it you don't know how to navigate please let me know so i'm still going to drop the link to download this template below the description of where you're seeing this so that you can also get yours and do well to share this video to anyone who might need this simple template. Thank you.